Hello YouTube Pipers, Double O Pipe here, aka Rick. I'm going to go with my Savinelli Bing's favorite again, and I've gone back to my Velvet. I didn't know if I was going to do this or not today, but then I got a package in the mail from tobaccopipes.com and I thought I'd do a bit of a pipe op or a bit of a package opening I ordered this the first of the week or over the weekend I'm not sure one of the other two So here we are. I haven't been smoking a pipe much the last few days. This is the first one in two days. know whether I'm losing a taste for it or or what but anyway package addressed to me I'll be honest, I forgot what I ordered. That's pretty sad. I don't know whether it's age or... Well, it looks like I should have done this before I turned the camera on, huh? I'm showing how age has affected my strength. a Dr. Graybull Royal Duke Tobacco Pipe. Smooth. I thought I got some tobacco with it, but I guess I didn't. The perfect codger packaging <laughs> that's the way they were when they were hanging up in the in the drugstore isn't that something royal duke filter pipe smooth smoking premium imported briar made in america by americans This Dr. Gray bow pipe has been carefully crafted in the Blue Ridge Mountains of North Carolina. Our employees, many with more than 40 years in pipe making, bring a total of some 1,400 years of skill to creating the best value for quality pipes available in the USA today. Made with quality, natural Mediterranean briar, each pipe passes through 52 production phases with control checks at every stage. Every Dr. Gray bow pipe is unique. Care should be taken when using your new pipe for the first six or seven times. Fill, half fill the bowl for the first few smokes and then alternate between full and full bowls for the Next three or four, this allows the heel of the bowl and the bowl itself to develop an even 
protective carbon coating which will extend the life of your pipe. The carbon will then build on the inside of the bowl and provide a natural heat shield which protects the briar bowl. The carbon layer should be allowed to build up until it is no more than the thickness of a dime. Well, let's break this open and see what it feels like in the hand. Royal Duke Dr. Graybo. No number. I don't know if there's a coating or a stain in there, but it's darkened. It's not, it's not like it's just raw wood. I'm going to have to try that one very soon. So how is everybody? The days here have been mighty nice, sunny, a little on the warm side, but that's what you get when you live here in the south. I remember watching my dad do that when he smoked Lucky's. He was pretty good at it. I'm trying to think, my granddad did that. I don't remember him ever doing that. Wasn't there a is this the week or day that it's smoke ring blowing? Or was that last week? was pretty much it. Got a bit of a breeze here. It's not easy to do it when you got breeze. I think I saw my dad do that once. Blow a smoke ring. As it expanded, he'd blow another one through it. Okay, folks. That's pretty much all I got to say today. New pipe. Very small pipe small bowl but it'll be fun to smoke hope everybody's doing okay weekend's coming up
Don't know if you got plans or not, but if you do, hope they work out for you. Everybody take care of yourself. Take care of your friends. Watch out for each other. God bless you. Until the next time. Bye-bye.